the all new Squid Vibe. The Squid Trex is unlike anything you've ever fished. It's got a patent pending design which allows it to vibrate when you lift it and shimmy on the fall. The internal weight balance is designed to sink fast for fishing deep water. Available in four sizes and eight colours featuring UV and glow patterns, the Squid Trex also has Squid Scent added to the super durable TPE material. There's a heap of different ways you can fish the Squid Trex. Let me show you how. The first one is on an overhead slow pitch jigging outfit. I really like fishing the Squid Trex on a slow pitch rod. I like one that's got a reasonably stiff tip. You can ideally just let it down to the bottom. And the first technique is literally just a little slow hop. You can see the rod tips really vibrating here. And it's quite slow. So this would be a technique you'd use for sort of deeper water, demersal, reef species, snappers, groupers, that type of thing. Very, very effective as just a slow hop off the bottom. So the lure is actually sitting on the bottom. You give it that little flick and it just kind of vibrates up. I'll quite often just flick it up and then just like let it sit there for a little bit and the tentacles just kind of like waft around and that's often when you'll get hit. It's on that little lift and vibrate and then just kind of like sit there and you're like waiting, 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 boom, got him. So that's the first technique, extremely effective. The other way that you can fish the squid tracks is obviously like a fast jig, just a conventional style metal jig type retrieve. You literally just this type of deal and that can be extremely effective as a reaction bite. So fish, even a fish sitting on the bottom sees it, chases it up, grabs it, or if you're chasing fish that are mid-water in a school and they see this going through it and it's a squid looking like it's in trouble, it just gets that reaction bite. So the other incredibly effective technique for the squid tracks, possibly the hardest one, is just the dead boat technique. You're actually better off putting it in a rod holder. So as a fisherman, it's very hard to have a lure that you know has got a really cool action and not wanna, you know, actually work it like that. So the squid treks can absolutely be fished dead boat. Literally put it in a rod holder, whatever else you're doing, drop one down to the bottom, put it in the rod holder, just leave it. If you can't put it in the rod holder and you actually wanna fish it, just really subtle like this down on the bottom because those tentacles are just kind of wafting around on the bottom. You know, a squid in the water actually just sort of sits there. The tentacles just move a little bit, but it just sits there looking natural. And that's what the Squid Trex does really, really well. It looks natural in the water, the tentacles waft around, and it smells like a squid. So the fish are 100% gonna eat this thing while it's just sitting still. Squid Trex is a super versatile lure. There's a heap of different ways you can use it. It's available in a great range of colors and sizes everything eats a squid. So no matter what species you are chasing, there's a squid tracks for the job.